Hello, my friends. Welcome back to Melanie Smith Stamps. I am Melanie, and I'm happy to have you visiting today. If you haven't visited my channel before, I want to say welcome, and I'm excited to have you here today. I hope by the end of the video, you've enjoyed your time, and you've hit that like and subscribe button. I am blessed to be a part of Alt News guest design team, and I have some beautiful products here that they have shared with me. So I just want to share them with you as well. This is the Butterfly Dreams die and stamp set. This is a cute little mini delight set, and it makes the most adorable little birdhouse. I have made a few samples with this, and you will see all of my samples over on my Instagram at Melanie Smith Stamps, and also on Facebook, in my Facebook group. This is the Dynamic Duo Painted Floral Swag and its coordinating sets. And this one, I'm just gonna grab a sample real quick because I just wanted to show this to you guys. This is a sample that I created with this set. And we are gonna be playing with this marble plate today. That's what we're gonna be hot foiling. So I wanted to show you this because this is what the plate looks like when it's better pressed, but we're actually gonna be hot foiling it. So don't leave just yet. You wanna see what we got planned with that. So that is the Dynamic Duo Painted Floral Swag. Then there's Build a Garden. That is another collection here, and it is the Exotic Two Bros. And we have the stamp, I have the add-on coordinating die and the stencil and then treasured memories and I have to say that I picked this set because of the sentiments these sentiments if you ever have those moments that are truly ones that are hard to create cards for your sympathy your encouragement things like that I know we all have them and they're very hard to find the perfect sentiment for this is your set and you can get the coordinating dies with it as well. This is a gorgeous set to have. Fondly remembered, deeply missed. May memories bring comfort. Be happy. I miss you dearly. Love you. Thanks for all the good times. Embrace the moment. Wishing you peace. Memories never fade away. And strength. Sending love and strength. We all need encouragement, guys. And to me, this was a must-have so I want to just put those aside those are your collections and then these are some extras from the deco line that they have released that I also picked up the deco fan is a hot foil plate it is gorgeous and then there's the deco cover die it is a full panel die set here that has the three options of sizes and then the three items we are going to be playing with today. We are going to be using the Streamline Sprig as our focal point. We're going to use one of the little deco greetings as our greeting. And then, as I said, we are going to jump in and hot foil this gorgeous gilded marble better press plate. And remember, better press can be both pressed and hot foiled, so they're always a two for one special. You get your most bang for your buck with the better press. So let's jump in. And before I forget to mention, I do also have a better press babes Facebook group. So make sure you check that out if you love anything better press. So I'm going to jump out and get the hot foil machine and we will get started. Okay, I've got my glimmer machine all heated up, so I'm going to place my better press plate right there. And as you can see, it's already well loved. That beautiful diagram or coloring there came from this gorgeous plate here. This inking of this better press piece. I just love how I achieved that rainbow. I'm hoping to have a second video coming up sometime on my channel of showing how I did this and we'll do the better press rainbow together and possibly have some other fun backgrounds so I'm gonna hit the timer here and as this warms up let me tell you a little bit about the Alta new giveaway today as you hop along in the May hop 
Altu is giving away $300 in prizes. So five of you have the chance to actually win today. So the grand prize winner is going to win a $100 gift card. And four of you are going to win $50 gift cards. So how do you win? Let me tell you. There is a list of participants down in the description below, along with all of the links to all the supplies that I've shared with you today. All you have to do is visit each of our videos today, watch along, comment on everybody, and we would appreciate it if you would like and subscribe. That is all there is to it. Make sure you make the full round of everyone in the list. Get lots of crafty inspiration. Let us know what you think. And I wish you good luck, my friends. Timer is already ready. So we are going to go ahead and undock this. And I'm going to place my hot foil shiny side to the plate. And then I am going to hot foil on this mirror card. And we'll see what that looks like. So let's go ahead and put that down right there. I'm going to put my plates on top of that to create the sandwich. I'm going to run this through my Platinum 6, which is right here off screen. We'll just run that through real quick. And I will put this back in. And let's see what we get. Look at that goodness. You ready for the reveal? Check that out. Oh my goodness. Isn't that gorgeous? Now we're going to use this today as a border on our card. So I'm going to put away the glimmer machine and then we'll pop back and we'll start to do a little ink blending together to finish our card front okay so now we're going to take the streamlined sprig die set and this die set comes with four dies you have the outline of the flower kind of sort of like a silhouette then you have these inner pieces that can be laid behind here you can also choose to insert those pieces here that fall out and the pieces are large enough to where you could inlay each of them which is nice so you have multiple options here for techniques and what we're going to do is I've die cut these three pieces out of white cardstock and we're going to ink blend these and then lay them behind these three pieces here which I'm going to cut with gold foil so that is going to be our design on the front of our card so I have got the three pieces we're going to ink blend here on my stamp wheel. And I've got some of my ink brushes here from Altenew. And I'm just going to do the leaf first. I'm choosing to do it in Volcano Lake. And I'm going to start with the, um, the lightest color first. And one thing I love about Altenew's ink brushes blending brushes is that they're very controllable so you can get light to dark ink blending and this is the lightest color so I'm going in and I'm just going over everything right now and then I'm going to go in darker with my next color so here is Volcano Lake and this one here you can build up some drama by coming in a little at a time and just giving that a good blend there and when you're working with dye based inks like these you have to remember that your ink is going to dry back a little bit so it will lighten as it dries so would you see how you can build that up slowly? I really like that you can do that with these ink brushes, these blender brushes. And these are by far my favorite size. They have 
um, really detailed ones and they have the small ones and then they have these and then they have the really large ones and I love this size it is my favorite there we go okay I think I'm happy with that I just wanted a definition from dark to light I like that drama right there okay so I'm gonna go ahead and stop with that one. That was Volcano Lake and Lagoon. Then we will switch over to Iceberg. And we're gonna do these other two in Iceberg and Ultramarine. So we'll start with this one. And we're just gonna do both of these in Iceberg first. These little ink cubes go on sale at Altenew all the time. So. If you're liking these colors or anything like that, make sure you check the website. Um, I'll make sure to link everything down below in the description so you can find anything that you might be interested in. But they do go on very good specials. I am blending today on um, Hammer Mill, 100 pound. That's the card I am using. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna leave it a little white up there at the top. Not too much ink up there at the top. Leaving a highlight there. And then I'm gonna come in with Ultramarine for that drama. Oh yeah. Doesn't that just change everything? That just makes me happy. <laughs> I love that. And you know, the Art Deco scene was all about drama. So that's one thing I liked about this color scheme, this drama. It was like, oh yeah. I was looking on Pinterest and looking at colors and everything. And that's where I got the color idea for the foil that we used was the Art Deco scene. If you look on Pinterest and just search Art Deco color schemes, you'll see they're just dramatic and just gorgeous. So if you like Art Deco, these are for you. Look at that. Okay. So that is our ink blending. And I'm going to leave it pale at the top. I want it to be pale. Just get it a really good blend there between the two colors. So we have a really good blend. There you go. And as like I said, as that dries, it's going to soften even more. All right, so there's our ink blending. Now I'm just going to die cut, um, I'm gonna die cut the gold flower and trim down our border piece and we will put our card together. Okay, here is our card base and I have that sentiment there. And we're just going to go ahead and glue our, oops, our side panel panel on. Glue this on the side here. Like so. Okay, we can set that aside. They're really pretty. Then we will take these pieces here and I will add just a little glue on here. And add this to here. Like so. Do the same on this one. Oops.
Okay. Let's put it in right there. There we go. Okay. Okay, then we'll bring our card back over and we're going to do a little of this to here. And we will place this right here. For our finished card. And one last card I'd love to show you is this one right here. This shows you just another card example of this being done in foil and this gorgeous being done in better press. So that is just a few of my cards that I have made from this month's collection. And I hope you've enjoyed the video and that you hop along with us today and craft along with all of us. And as always, I want to craft life with you. So like and subscribe and let's do life together. Have a great one, my friends, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.